So we're right here on Southern Boulevard where we did watch President Trump's motorcade glide by us here on Southern uh, just shortly after you left the airport where you were. It only takes a few minutes to get here on his way to Mar-a-Lago. People lined up along Southern Boulevard between the route trying to get a glimpse of the presidential motorcade. First they saw the motorcycles and then the guard cars and then of course the SUVs containing the president, his staff, Ivanka Trump, Jared Kushner and their two children. We saw both some protesters and some Trump supporters on this side of the Southern Boulevard Bridge. But for the most part, the handful of people that we saw here were Trump supporters. They tell me they want to make sure that they think he does a good job and they like what he's doing. Because I love our new president and I'm here to show him that we respect him. No matter what the media says or the news says, we are here for Trump. What it'll do is we got to keep the uh, Congress and the Senate on their feet. They do a thorough investigation, no in-house investigation, a thorough investigation by party uh, committee and let it all come out because we have a problem. And A1A is closed from Southern Boulevard North to North County Road. You cannot get through Palm Beach while the president is in town this weekend. And the closing roads issue might be somewhat solved when the president is able to finally construct his helipad right here on the lawn of Mar-a-Lago. That way he can fly directly from the airport. And so all of these perimeter roads and adjacent roads will not have to be shut down. However, it's likely that that A1A will still remain shut while the president is at Mar-a-Lago, the Winter White House. Live in Palm Beach, I'm Terry Parker, WPBF 25 News.